so now we've gone we've changed format so here's the information I just entered in but now we're actually into the process it looks like yeah exactly now the first so the first page was a sort of um, uh, general description page for us for the system to be able to take you to the correct form uh, okay yep that makes sense all right so but there's a few more things here by the looks of things the principles Indeed. reference number uh, what is a reference number? That would be, in this case, perhaps uh, uh, the area number that, that uh, you would be using for uh, for your study. Perhaps. Okay. All right. No, I don't have anything there for the moment. But it doesn't have this red dot, so it's not no, compulsory it's not, it's anyway. Not uh, responsible department. That will be Department of Earth Science. And then create a principal investigator, those who are responsible for the data and the intellectual content. I think if I'm if I may uh yep. say something there, you would you would need to put that in the English. Yeah, exactly. Uh, you have to give both okay. <laughs> where where possible. Of course this wouldn't work in a in a um, English speaking university, for instance, but <laughs> I'd be really embarrassed if that's wrong. <laughs> uh, okay, a prince, create a principal investigator. So it's got me um, and I guess I can fill the rest of that one. Huh? Okay, and an orc -y D. Now I was a bit prepared, so I went and got my org ed <laughs> earlier. Uh, is it just the is it just the numbers? Yeah, you can just give the number. Like that. Okay, exactly. that looks good. And then, um, what's this one? Copy to contact person for data. That's if uh, if if um, there's another field further down, which is contact person for data. Oh, yeah, um, and right. that's okay. yeah. All right. So if I do that one there, then I get another David Rayner, but with everything filled in. Is that right? Exactly. All right. Exactly. Kill, kill this one. Remove, yes. Selected the contact information should be made visible in the research data catalog. Uh, I guess so. So if I if I like don't click that, it's just for internal contact for you, for SND. Exactly. Exactly. Your name is still going to appear as the principal investigator, so... This is just oh, okay. to make things clearer. All right. In this case, since uh, since it's the same person. All right. Oh, we can stay there. All right. Well, I actually have a lot of other um, creator principles to add. So why don't I do that offline? So we've uh, filled out our big list of authors uh, for this paper, um, and they're not actually in the right order because my name got put up first but I'm not the first author um, so can I just drag here ah, yeah you that. should be able to do that Solved. okay so I had a few things we've had some people didn't have orc ID but that wasn't compulsory um, the other thing was some people had more than one institution or affiliation listed on the paper and you can only enter one affiliation, so we just took the first listed affiliation. We'll think about that later, but everyone's everyone's on the list now. Uh, contact, I can be the contact for the metadata contributor. So what's the difference, actually, if you between your creator principal investigators and your contributors? Yeah, contributors are... Not the, the the practical reason is that contributors are not included in the citation that is uh, created as a suggestion. Oh, okay. Um, All right. Check the data. Does it contain personal data? No, it's just meteorological data in this study, so that's easy. Just kind of other protected information, uh, like species protective audience. No. Check if the data shall be made available for closed review. Um, what would this one be? This is usually 
uh, when when researchers are submitting uh, articles to journals and the journals sometimes d demand or require that the data is made available for review and then published side by side with the article so this is a way for us for them to make the data available for the journals without publishing it so that it can be reviewed okay all right. for publication so ours is already published so we're good uh, possible restrictions no no embargo funding information actually we did not have funding for this project so that's easy ethical review if the study has been ethically reviewed parts of it i'll say were ethically reviewed the um because we compared with ambulance data so we didn't need ethical review for that even if this meteorological data is no <laughs> uh okay uh, so ethical consent was concerned by da 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 Right, so first step is done.